Um, hmm. So what would you be? What would you define yourself as out of all these things? How strong are you? I'm very weak. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll go below average. I'm not atrophying. <laughs> I guess I'll go average. Your, your muscles are just deteriorating constantly. Yeah. <laughs> How quick are you? I'm, I'm so quick on my feet, bro. That's why you play, like, when we were kids and we played video games the whole time. So, like, yeah, we're just, like, increasing, like, our dexterity, man. Oh, yeah. yeah. And, and uh, like, New Vegas and stuff, I always was, like, you know, max, Whoa. max charm. Whoa. Because, like, you can just talk your way out of every situation, right? <clears throat> and I'm super smart. You have to pick something as negative, right? You can't... Oh, you have one point remaining. Yeah. Oh, so you could, like, put one negative to then gain yeah, more so points. Yeah, so let's have my my muscles <laughs> deteriorate. It's practically a hobby. Go. Infinite charisma. <laughs> Wizard build. Wizard build? Hmm. So, yeah. So I need to be super smart. You would. Just for fun. You would. Oh, I so would. <laughs> Did you ever play the uh, 24 game? Hell yeah. Yeah. No, I thought it was like 2048 or something. What? <laughs> oh, you know. No, that... where you're given four numbers and you have to you make, 24. make 24 with those numbers. I do that all the time. Yeah, you told me you do that with like license plates on the road. I do. Yeah. I really do. <laughs> Did you ever play 2048? You know what I'm talking about? Where you, it, you had like, never mind, never mind, it's way too complicated. Okay, um, temperament, I'm, I'm very hot-headed. Robert's here, Harry Pujols. Hey, it's Joe. <laughs> um, I guess, oh, I have a point remaining. I'll, I'll be more perceptive. Next. Next. Oh my god, what is all this? <clears throat> holy, free holy. Where is the, the wizard option? <laughs> How to wizard? Uh, science is basically magic, right? Uh, yeah, is that what? Oh, tech. But you want also want to be like a very talkative wizard, right? Talkative wizard. <laughs> well, that's what you said. You wanted like super a lot of charm. Yes, I can talk magic at people. <laughs> it's like using the force. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I just see in the middle, farmer dirt. <laughs> Man, I love me some dirt. <laughs> Is that how you spell plowing? Plowing? <laughs> Plow. It st you stayed for the plowing, planting, pruning, and plucking. Hmm. That doesn't seem very magical to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, safety inspector? Seems magical. Oh, a chef. No, oh, one-handed melee. Chef? Boo. All these things seem like sim jobs you get in The Sims. I've been a janitor before in real life. Oh, oh. <laughs> it is you. Yeah, okay, that's what I'm going to pick. <laughs> Sanitation class. What do you do? You spend your evenings kneeling over ominous stains with a bottle of caustic solvent and an absorbent rag. How the blood got there is irrelevant above your pay grade and beneath your interest. You're an artist of erasure. Wow. That's so beautiful. I'm, yeah, I mean, that, that fits me to a T. When you're on the job, there's no trace to be found. Ooh. Wow. You're about to be cleaning up some mur moitas. I'm so good. Oh, my God. Here you are. That's me. <laughs> Don't be shy, it says. Don't be shy. <laughs> Don't be shy. All right. Gorgeous. I'm so... Look at me. I'm, oh. I'm going to clean up some stains like you, don't, you <laughs> like wouldn't you would believe. believe. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's not take too long on this. Make it look like you. That looks like Paul Rudd. I could be a good Paul Rudd. <laughs> this, what? this doesn't look like Paul Rudd. It so does. Oh, you know who this looks like? Be Paul Rudd. You know, you know who this looks like? Paul Rudd. No. <laughs> <laughs> he totally does. The Adventures of Paul Rudd. <laughs> Above everything else, be Paul.
Paul Rudd. B. Paul Rudd. All right, where's where's the Paul Rudd guy? He was like two or something. No. Yeah, there, there it's yeah. Paul Rudd. All right, and of course I'm He's so as pale. pale as possible. <laughs> yeah. Option two, please. Thank you. <laughs> so pale. He's so pale, but it kind of fits. Like looking at the camera. Whoa, your eyes, dude. Whoa, that's like you're some... like a lizard. No, wizard. Because oh. I'm a magic man. Oh. <laughs> He's a magic man. Uh, I don't remember what Paul's eyes... I, Paul Rudd's eyes look like. I don't look into Paul Rudd's eyes very often. All right. <laughs> well, that, I mean, it's about Paul Rudd's hair. Whoa! Whoa! Dude, he's got a fade, bro. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> uh... No, it's not. Whoa. <laughs> there, that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. And he looks so prim and proper, too. Like, I need to straighten up my back for this. It's some good posture. Yeah. Ooh, purple. There's 50 choices. That's a lot of choices. Let's just go 50. <laughs> mm. Just go black. There you go. Great. Oh, it's like a silver fox. Yeah. Ooh. Mm. There are way too many color options. We would be here for like 50 years, you guys, yes. if we were to do this like super correctly. No, 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 no. Number one. That's perfect. <laughs> Let's give him a little little stubble, though. Yeah, he's been sleeping in a... Oh! <laughs> he's been sleeping for God knows how long. <laughs> Was that the story? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he was Walt Disneying it up in a uh, hibernation yeah. chamber. Oh, Paul Rudd would be a great Walt Disney. Oh, he would. All right, features. Give him some makeup. Oh. <laughs> you know, three hundred years in the oh future. Oh my God! Look what Coffee Cup just did. How? Oh my! That's how many. Because <laughs> there would be so many color options. How many is that? Twenty-two <laughs> trillion. 900? Wait, no. No, 22, that's billion. 22 billion. That, no, that's million. Look, there's no commas in there. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. There you go. <laughs> it was a... Ooh. Oh, man. Are we really going to do this to Paul? Paul Rudd can get it. You, he's going to come out of the hibernation chamber after like 300 years and with a full face this of is makeup. Like, this is like negative makeup. Yeah. Throw some dirt on him. Rub some dirt on it. Oh, God, he's so old. No, Paul Rudd, his whole thing is how he's, like, eternal. Yeah, like, he doesn't age. Yeah. But we gotta give him a scar, too. Yeah, that's why. He got a scar, and then his acting career was over. So he no, had he, to hibernate. No, he fell face first into the hibernation tube, mm. and he got this scar. <laughs> Ant-Man has seen as he shit. As he landed on his face. Yeah. Okay, done. Good. Look at that. Come Look on. At that. That's what do you that's guys a, think? That is a handsome man right there. What do you guys think of Paul Rudd? Do you do you guys approve? <laughs> that's Just, that's all you need. That's, that's a first date. I like it. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, Paul <laughs> Rudd. <laughs> Enter. <laughs> No, next. Literally talked about how Paul Rudd is a great example of how men age better than women today. I'm not taking offense to that because I agree. And if you were to mix, like, the genetic uh, makeup of Paul Rudd and Gwen Stefani, you'd have the eternal human being. They would just never grow old. Yeah, Gwen Stefani's doing pretty good for herself, too, huh? Yeah, she's pretty hot. 